Catalytic converter thefts continue to be a problem here in southwest Virginia, according to local auto shop owners. 10 News reporter Amy Cochran is working for you to find out what cars are the most susceptible, plus what you can do to prevent the theft from happening to you. It's a big thing. People are short on cash right now with how things are going with the economy and COVID and everything like that that's happened. So people are looking to make a quick buck and that's one of the easiest ways they're going to do it. Carson East is the owner of Southwest Muffler in Christiansburg. He frequently sees people in his shop dealing with catalytic converter thefts. And the standard cost, I mean, you're going to range anywhere from 350 to almost $1,000 for some of them. I mean, they're very expensive things. He says certain cars are more likely to be hit. Kias, uh, Hyundais, um, vehicles like that, again, the hybrids are the top dollar right now. Plus, where you park plays a role. More towards the cities is the biggest problem right now where there's street parking, parking garages, places like that where there's not a whole lot of cameras, um, but there's a lot of cars to choose from. He says one of the preventative measures you can take is installing a deterrent, a shield, cage, or special threaded bolts. They're cutting the pipe on either end. If you have a cage on that or even just your basic standard heat shield that's wrapped around that, it makes it a lot harder to cut through. People caught stealing a catalytic converter could face up to five years in prison. A law passed last year upped the punishment from a class one misdemeanor to a class six felony. In Christiansburg, Amy Cockrum, 10 News, working for you.